to my audience out there. Is it okay to smash your friend's ex? Y'all stay tuned. Salute to the MABW team. I'm back with another video. MABW team, to the men out there, let me talk to you real quick today, okay? I have a question to my men. Is it okay to mess with a friend, your homeboy, somebody you possibly know? Is it okay to mess with their ex, their baby mother? Is that okay to do? Do you think it's fine that you mess with someone's girlfriend that you know? You went to school with that guy. You know him very well. Y'all have talked in passing. Y'all probably even hung out together. Hung out in the same circle together. Is it okay to do? Now, I'm going to give my honest opinion on this. Your boy MABW... I don't think that's fine to do. And I have family members, boys, cousins who have done that before. And I personally don't think it's right. I think that any man that you have known, possibly grown up with, y'all have hung out together. Y'all are buddy buddy. I don't think that is cool that if that man breaks up with his girlfriend or he isn't messing with his baby mother anymore, I don't think it's right that you take that route and mess with that girl. I think that should be an off-limits type thing. I think that should be an off-limits type thing. Now, I have also have known women who don't care about messing with another lady's baby father. And she could know the girl. And I think that's wrong too. Men, we got to start having more principles out here, okay? You have to start having more morals out here. Stop messing with somebody you know has dealt with that person. Stop messing with that lady. And a lot of times when these women do stuff like that, as far as messing with a homeboy, they're doing it to make that man mad. That's why they're doing it. In the past, when I was younger, I've dealt with girls and I didn't even know, honestly, that they pretty much knew somebody I knew. And this is when I was young. This is like early, early 20s, probably when I was a teen, to be honest with you. But you will hear these girls get into arguments with their baby fathers or their uh, boyfriend. And then they'll say, that's why I mess with so-and-so. I've only been confronted one time on that. And I went to school with this guy. And thank God we didn't get into a scrabble over it. Because I never knew that was his baby mother. And this was in my early, early 20s. I was messing with this girl from out of town. And she was actually dealing with a guy who lived in my city. It was her baby father. And she pretty much was like, she seen me at a nightclub. And she wanted to talk to me. One thing led to another. We were talking for a while. We ended up messing around. And then one day when I was out on the streets gambling, because your boy MABW, I used to be in the hood gambling too, sometimes shooting dice, shooting craps. My man confronted me like, yo, man, that's messed up. Uh, K, you messed with my baby mother. And I'm like, yo, I didn't know that was your baby mother. And, and I told him, I said, in all honesty, I was talking to her like on some not just to smash type level. I was talking to, like, I, w I was like a gentleman about it. I wasn't on some, like, oh, I just, uh, so what? Like, I wasn't trying to act all tough or nothing like that. I was just telling him, like, yo, it wasn't just one of these things where I was talking to her to just smash her. Like, I was talking to her because, you know, I actually was kind of feeling her. I actually was had some type of interest in her. And I was hanging out with her. We would go out to eat and do things, you know. And, you know, a lot of the other guys on the block... <laughs> It was like, oh, man, not kid, not K, not Kenny. The Kenny ain't do that. Tell me you ain't do that, Ken. I was like, yo, I didn't know. But women, you need to stop doing that. 
Stop doing that all the time. Stop smashing another guy to make your baby father, especially, and you could have sex with whoever you want, but I think it's corny when you baby mothers or ex-girlfriends try to smash guys that we know. And I also think it's corny that when women are in relationships with you and they know that one of your homeboys tried to make a move on, on them and they won't tell you who it was, I think that's corny as well. And I've been through that before. I've dealt with a lady who actually would not tell me which one of my homeboys was trying to talk to her. Because I was on that type of time where like, man, none of my boys would ever try to talk to you. They, they not like that. And that's when I was a lost young man. You know, early 20s, teen, in, in your teens, early 20s, you're lost. You're like, man, none of my boys is trying to do that. None of my boys is trying to smash you or talk to you. She'd be like, okay. You know how women just give you that, mm-hmm, okay. And it's like, okay, well, if it's, who is it then? Tell me who it is. Tell me who it is. And they won't tell you. Guys, that's a big red flag. That's a big red flag. If your girlfriend will not tell you which one of her homeboys is trying to smash her, that's a big red, red flag. Because that's telling me that a guy that I know or hang around doesn't have any integrity or principles at all. He doesn't have to be loyal to me. I'm not going to sit up there and say he has to be loyal. But I'm just talking about morals and principles right now. And that shows that man doesn't have that. And that's not somebody I want to be around. That's not any man that I would want to be around. And it's like, why would you let me keep on hanging with a guy that's trying to hit on you consistently? That's why I say some women, not all, but some women don't have no care in the world when it comes to that. In my city, fellas... There's been men who have been bodied because of women's mistakes out here that they were purposely doing just to make their boyfriend or baby father jealous. There have been men who have lost their life because that lady wanted to make her boyfriend or baby father jealous. That's why I say keep certain people off limits. I know a lot of guys, yes, we all, we all like getting bun. Sometimes we can look at other guys' ladies or their baby mothers and be like, yo, they're bad. But you have to have some type of morals, guys. Especially when you know that guy. Stop being slimy and stop being grimy like that. Stop it. Like, I've known people from blocks that I've been on. They were pretty much sleeping with dudes. They would be neck and neck. Like, like I'm talking about close with, like. Real close with. And I'm like, yo, why are you smashing her baby mother? That's your homeboy. This is somebody y'all y'all will go to war with each other. As far as like against the an, another side. And you're up here smashing his baby mother. That's not right to me. You're up here smashing his girlfriend. Maybe his wife. Dudes. I, I, I'm, I'm just here to say. Stop being devious like that, man. It's not right. It's not cool. Maybe some of y'all will do it. Maybe y'all like M-A-B-W, you tripping. If my homeboy got a bad baby mother or he not with her no more, I'm going to smash her. It's, it, it, she's off, it, it, it's fair game. But it, in my eyes, it's not fair game. If you know me and you rock with me, you should not be smashing an ex-girlfriend or a baby mother of mine. And that's just, it is what it is. It's not fair game in my eyes. It's not. And like I said, it happens. But I'm just talking of, listen, let, let's be clear. Your boy, it may be W. I'm not throwing this out there to make it seem like, oh, I care about who's messing with my kids' mothers or my ex-girlfriends that I've dealt with in the past. I'm not saying that. I'm just talking about morals and principles. And this is with women too. Women as well. Women need to stop smashing their homegirl's baby father or ex-boyfriends. It's about principles. I live off of principles and morals. And maybe because I grew up in the 80s and 90s era. So I live off different principles than most people do this day and age. Y'all let me know what y'all think about this video. Fellas, is it right to smash your homeboy's ex or his baby mother? And ladies, is it okay for you to smash your homegirl's ex or baby father? Y'all let me know in the comment section. Anyways, that's my video for today. If you like the video, of course, comment, like, and subscribe. It ain't costing you a damn thing. And of course, I'm going to holler back at y'all later. Peace.